The press is the most unique piece of equipment that we have in our entire factory. We take diamond powder, we put it in a press media such as this, this cube. We have six anvils that come in all at the same time. The machine itself weighs 26 tons. They go up to a million PSI squishing that cube together, then heat it up to 1500 degrees Celsius. And those diamond crystals grow together to form a solid diamond. Then comes right back down to room temperature, we pull it out. It is an amazing process. We take what Mother Nature does in millions and millions of years, we recreate that in 30 minutes, and we're able to create one solid diamond ring. Okay, at this point, we've taken 28 million of these little individual diamond crystals. We've pressed them in the press at a million PSI, 1500 degrees C, and we have now formed a solid diamond. First thing we do is we have to remove the protective cans. And so we go into a blasting room. If you were to put your hand in there, it would cut your finger off in a matter of seconds. We then want to go ahead and we want to make this parallel and take it to the right height. And so we go to a lab. Now in the lab, we take the same thing. We take some diamond, we set, we set our part down and it's just slowly eating away the diamond. And that'll get it to the rough height. Once we have the rough height, Next thing we want to do is we want to go in and we want to grind the outside of each ring. We then want to go work on the inside of the ring. And so we will go in on a machine that's got a little half inch wheel and it'll come in and it grinds the inside and put some entry bevels on it so that when you slide on your finger, it feels nice and comfortable. We'll then go in and, and do a finished grind on the height. Set our ring down on it and we'll take it to the exact height of the ring flip it over, do the next side. It gives us a nice, beautiful surface finish. From there, we'll go in and we'll do an edge prep. If it's a dome, it's just got a nice little entry bevel. If it's a beveled ring, we'll have we'll have more, a little bit more of an aggressive bevel on it. It probably takes some um, 20 to 30 minutes, each ring, each side. We got some very precise instruments to make sure that it is measured exact. So every ring that comes in goes out the exact same. Okay, so now what we do is we have basically a base ring. It's got some bevels on it, but it has no finish. A couple of the other machines on the finishing side, we have a wire EDM machine. It takes a really thin uh, wire and it runs current through it. And what we'll do is we'll take that and we'll create whatever edge we need to go in and if we're gonna put opal in it, or if we're gonna go, if we're gonna put any type of inlay, We'll use that machine to do that. Opal to be is an amazing product just because depending on the lighting, you get different colors that pop. Some of the products start out with material that looks like this and your finished product is something like this. It's, it's pretty amazing. Before we even start the opal, this ring's probably got eight man hours already put into the ring. Now we're gonna put in an additional two to two and a half hours. We have a very high end uh, UV resin. It gives you the ability to do a fast set. So, so as soon as we put the first layer in, we can then put it underneath the UV light and it sets it in place. Then we can rotate the ring, do the next section, next section, and then repeat that process over and over until we build the opal up where it's just, just above the ring. Then we'll go in with a file and sandpaper. We start with 240 grit sandpaper and we go clear up to 10,000 grit. Um, but we do that to get rid of all the scratches and you get the best finish we possibly can. So when you wear your ring, you have the best looking opal ring on the market. We put a lot of love in, into every one of our products, but the opal is a fun one for us because we get a lot of variety. It adds color that pops and it's very unique to our product. We also use our laser, which will go in and give us a any, any laser pattern, you know. We can do very custom stuff where we do, you know, letters, names. Um, very popular right now is everybody likes to put their wedding date or anything on the inside of the ring. But that's what we do on the finishing side. Um, we do a lot of buffing, a lot of polishing. And we do a lot of very custom stuff, um, but we are the most scratch resistant ring on the planet. Under normal wear and tear, you're not gonna get it scratched.